Hello everybody, we have a phone call from Professor Elm. We sure do. We, as soon as we left the gym, this popped up. Oh wait, what's my Professor Elm voice? Um, um, um. Think nerd. Think nerd. Channel the nerd. Oh no, it's me. <laughs> I remember. Um, I called because something weird is happening in the radio broadcast. They were talking about Team Rocket. Cheek, do you know anything about it? Nope, nope. Maybe Team Rocket has returned. No, that can't be true. Well, what if it is? Sorry to bug you. Take care. Bye. Remember to wear a jacket. <laughs> it's not my mom. <laughs> your mom isn't calling you. <laughs> my mom calls me to be like, hey, I spent your money. <laughs> my mom calls me. Names. Zeke, I hope. Yeah, usually. Oh, that's good. But sometimes she calls me Fred. She doesn't remember me too well. Oh. She's old, I'm putting her in a home. She'll be dead soon anyway. I thought you were going to say, like, she calls me Eric, and it's like, that's my brother. And that's fine. It's not fine. My mum cycles through, like, all four of her kids. Sometimes the dog, before she gets to the <laughs> name that she wants. It's true, sometimes the dog. Um, you've reminded me on the phone the other day. Mm -hmm. <laughs> my mum asked my brother if I was coming up on the phone. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she said, um, she knew you were at work. She'd just seen you at work. Yeah. So she phoned up my brother and was like, are, um, are Charlotte and Zeke coming up? And Eric was like, Charlotte's not coming up. She's like, I mean Charlotte and B. <laughs> no, I mean Zeke and B. <laughs> Oh, oh yeah, right, I remember this. Oh, oh, oh yeah, Team Rocket's taken over the radio tower. Yeah, they've taken over the radio tower, you can't go in, unless you're a member. Oh, members only. Oh, lag. see that lag? <laughs> Ooh, it's chugging away. Oh, oh, it hates this city. That's Bill's house. We can get an Eevee! Oh, we can. Let's get an Eevee. Eevee? Hi, Cheek, would you do something for me and take this Eevee? Mm. It came over when I was adjusting the connection that no longer exists. Oh, wow, that's a shame. Can I count on you to play with it, Cheek? I'll play oh. with your Eevee. Oh. <laughs> did you just make a dingle joke? <laughs> I did. Did you just make a joke about his dong? Yes. Ew, gross. No. <laughs> You're crazy. Who wants the Eevee if anybody wants the Eevee? Uh, do you want an Eevee? Not really. Or any of its evolutions? Not really, no. We should pick up an Eevee. What's the team look? Team looks like this. I love my boys. Me too. I don't wish that one was a higher level. It'll get there. It'll get there. It'll get there. Oh, that's, that's screw Eevee then. <laughs> yeah, screw it. Whatever. If we don't want it, we don't need it. Yes. We ain't complaining to Pokedex. Fuck Eevee. <laughs> Which version do you want? Let's go Eevee or let's go Pikachu? Well, let's go Pikachu, because I think it's the one you said has Ardish. It does have Ardish. I want Ardish. Charlotte, you haven't done the thing you needed to do yet. I thought this was it. Getting an Eevee? No. Go this way. <laughs> Whoa, it sped up. It I know what I'm doing. I was just going the wrong way. Is it this one or the next the one? Up one. It's up one. That one looks spooky. You're spooky. Oh. This is it, this is it, this is it. This is it. This is it. Are huh? you? This is it. Huh? Are you a newcomer too? We had to recruit new members from the Radio Tower mission. Then we ran out of uniforms. I heard the studio had some, so I decided to borrow some. When you change where? I'll just watch. Sweet. Look at you, pretty good. Put my hat oh, but you shouldn't try to scare people walking around looking like that, okay? Okay. Wow, what a considerate Team Rocket member. I know, look at my hat. It's backwards. Ugh, sassy. Mm, you know it. I love that you can dress up in a Team Rocket uniform, though. It's so cool. Yeah. I know my friend Mona went through a phase when she was playing this that she didn't want to continue the story. Because she'd lose the outfit. Because she'd lose the outfit. Ah. So like she spent a week just like, I don't want to change. Then when, when she did, you know, she was happy. Go on ahead. Alright. Because this happened. 
Oh. Stop going around in groups and troubling people, you cowards. I recognize that ass anywhere. Are you cheek? What are you doing here? No way. You think you're strong now that you look like them? That's like everyone I knew in in high school who dressed up like a gangster. Yeah. <laughs> I think they're tough because they look like them. <laughs> you shouldn't wear those things. Yeah, if you really love this bit where he just rips off your clothes. Oh my god. <laughs> What? You? You're not a newcomer. Well, come on, like, you don't have fucking <laughs> civilian clothes. You're a newcomer. <laughs> That's actually a full body tattoo and he's naked. <laughs> oh, God. I can't believe we were wearing two hats at once. Yeah, we're pretty good. Man, I can't find one hat that fits me. I don't want a hat that fit you and a hat. Yeah, I've got a fucking huge melon head. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> There's not much to say yeah. about it. It's hard to find hats that fit him. When I had, like, the last hat that I had that fit me was like on this big woolly beanie thing. And we lost it when we moved, which I was upset about. But I remember you trying it on, and it, um, it just, it, you couldn't put it on your head. It flopped over your yeah, whole it, head it, like a ski mask. It covered my eyes. It's like, oh, this is big. Yeah, it's just kind of like, I can't wear caps, because even at the biggest setting, you know, the little clip things at the back, yeah. doesn't fit. <laughs> those those Christmas paper hats you get out of crackers. No. No, they rip when I try and put them on. I mean, in all fairness, they rip for everybody else. It's just for you they rip quicker. Yeah, but I mean, other people can put them on. I've heard people say, oh, they're too big, I wear them like a necklace. Oh, no. And I'm like, you piece of shit. <laughs> you don't know the half of it. Let's see. Oh, the, the the jiggle jiggle puff. Yeah, don't look. I'll jiggle your puffs. Don't jiggle my puffs, you stay away. We're Team Rocket, in case you didn't remember. We had to Ooh, were you scared? <laughs> <laughs> they were scared. <laughs> oh, that's a full team. Magic Almost. Puff. That's a full team. He is five out of six. It is close enough. It's it's a pretty full team. Yes. He punched you like a sucker. How dare he? Oh, I got a stretch. This fight's too exciting. Whoa! Whoa. It died. Oh, cool. Yeah. I'm going to switch because now Pippi... Oh, no, Pippi's like on par. Pippi Ian. is on point. Ian needs some help. Ian Seal. Ian Seal. <laughs> Look, doing his little claps. Ian. Should probably put Ian out first. Though. Yeah, that's sort of what I'm oh, thinking. Although he does have the experience share, doesn't he? He does, yeah. But he'll get more if he actually fights, won't he? Yeah, it's, it's just I was thinking it's not a huge deal if he doesn't fight. Oh, we can't one shot. I shot. Yeah. Took a punch. Oh, hey, yeah. yeah. I'm using a priority move, but his priority has more priority. Yeah. Check your priority. Um, I will, I'll look it up now. Okay. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> Priority tier list. <laughs> uh, keep, keep Ian out. Okay. Level up, boy up. Oh, we'll try. Oh, succeed. I'm trying to succeed. Don't try, just succeed. You succeed. You suck Ian. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. We have fun here making jokes about dingles. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Help me. Why? No <laughs> reason. Do, do you want help? Oh, I'm pressing B again. Stop. <laughs> help me. <laughs> I have to live with this, you B pressing motherfucker. I'm sorry. I'm used to the <clears throat> switch. Where A is B and X is Y. Imagine how much trouble we're going to have when we play Let's Go. Oh, God. <laughs> and we're having to sort of, like, counter our counter adjustments. No, no, no it'll be easy because we're going to do it two-player. So we'll each have a Joy-Con, so it won't be like we're holding a standard controller. So you think it will be out of our comfort zone already? Yeah. Okay. So I don't think it'll hit those, like, nerves. Oh, nerves. Those nerves. That muscle memory, it won't confuse it. Uh, get to my nerves. Ooh. 
It's my nerds. <laughs> I hate people who are smarter. Ooh, ooh. Do you know what? I think I'd like Aqua Ring more than rest. But it's up to you, because it's your Pokemon. Uh, it's my Pokemon. Mm, it is silly to have two, and I do dislike having two Pokemon. Mm. I love it. Mm. I slept for like 12 hours today, but it's because I'm sick. Ooh, you fool you. Shuffling around in that chair. Oh no! Oh, he dead. No! He dead of them. No! Dead. Not dead of them, eh? Like an elephant that's dead. Dead of them. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> What the fuck are we talking about? I have no idea, we're just rambling. Yeah. Whatever, it's fun. Rapper, rapper, rapper. Well, it's, it's nice just like. It's nice recording things like this and like even having, a, you know, even having just one or two people that think, I want to watch this today. Yeah. I think that's really cool because like. We're not doing anything super special, it's like. This is literally just how we hang out. Yeah. Like, we play so many single player games together. And we just talk about dingles. <laughs> <laughs> and, like, we tell the dog to stop barking at nothing in the garden. And... Yeah. It, it's, it's cool that even if it's just you and me hanging out and not really doing anything, that some people are like, that's entertaining. Yeah, I feel like that's happening with like, the Game Grumps and stuff, though. It's yeah, just, like... just on a phenomenally bigger scale. Yeah. Well, you know, that was how... Oh, that... It's not how Aaron and John started. When they started, they were banking off their success of their other channels. Yeah, well... But it's how, like, a lot of people started. Yeah. Yeah, like, um, I like Northern Lion, and when I first subscribed to him, he was literally in Korea recording Isaac episodes on a laptop and like <laughs> I remember him saying that people were like you used to sound way more relaxed in your old videos and he was like I was literally in bed with a laptop on my stomach recording those episodes <laughs> ultimate relaxation <laughs> yeah he was like I was pretty fucking comfy <laughs> can't have been nice to play though <laughs> I mean why would he do it if it wasn't I guess. Oh, well. He found his pattern. He did. Play Isaac for 50 years, upload 5 episodes a day. Oh, he's such a workaholic. People work on You've got to be if you want to be successful. I know, and like, I do quite a lot of editing. Mm. But it's. it's that's like. Because I do editing, even though I don't do a hell of a lot, I just do little bits every now and then. Yeah. It's like, it takes a long time to do those little bits. It's the reason that I don't think I could upload one a day, at least not now. I'm sure you could get there eventually, or once, you know, you're in... <clears throat> not, not in, like, the editing routine, but, uh... Like, once you know the shortcuts and how to do things quick, then... Yeah. Hope one of them and healed me. They didn't. Nah, they bitches. Three years ago, Team Rocket was forced to disband, but we're making a comeback here. With a new hit single. <laughs> <laughs> Why else do they want the radio tower? I'm a rocket man, standing alone. <laughs> Whatever, I fucked it up. There's a joke in there, you got it, fuck you. Sounds like nothing. I'm gonna disable you. <laughs> You'll be in a wheelchair for life. True. Mm, what a jerk, right? No. Mm. Mm. Keep battling. You got this, Pippi. Yeah, because Ian's dead, right? Yeah. Yeah. You probably should have revived him. Oh yeah, it's kind of thank you. <sighs> kind of fault because the other gra Grimo was dead. Oh. That's what Graveler. Because if Grimo was dead, I could actually Whoa. play with the dance. You should switch. <laughs> I switched to Benedict. Oh, oh sorry. Okay, I was, I was thinking cause it's going to use Mud Bomb again and send a flying type out. Oh, no, no he just shrunk. Well, great. Great. great He's great, minimizing great. his waste. What a <laughs> good boy. Oh. Remember to recycle. Cycle! That's what the Alolan one's about. 
Yeah. It just eats garbage and it's super clean. Great. Even though it's disgusting and scary. <laughs> Speaking of disgusting and scary, it's nowhere near as scary as the Alolan. It's not. <laughs> the Alolan one has a big effing teeth. Yes, it does. This one's just like, I'm made of your poo. Why are you shitting purple? <laughs> I don't know, why is Poppet missing? Why are you shitting tongues and eyeballs in purple? I'm not shitting tongues and eyeballs. It grew those itself. But I am shitting purple. Yes, I eat far too much beetroot. Yeah. Oh, I'm poisoned. Ah, oh, shit. It doesn't matter how much I am using them, it's not going to help. Uh, when my brother was um, really little, I think before I was born, but like I've been told the story, about how they thought that they had to take him to hospital because he was peeing red, but then it turned out he'd eaten like three whole beetroots by himself. <laughs> oh, kids, eh? Yeah. Anything to scare their parents. I don't want to go to school. Um, 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 um. <laughs> Mom, my pee's red. Is that bad? <laughs> <laughs> oh, son, you're just on your period. Oh. Oh. I don't want to go to school. I'd rather go to the emergency room. Oh, I hate to be going to the emergency room. So I've seen like, it's slightly off topic, but I've seen like Yahoo answered questions that are just like, I haven't started my period yet. I'm a 15 year old boy. Oh my. And it's like, God. Oh, somebody give you sex ed, please. They must have had it, right? I don't know. Oh, I, I know when I was in school. We had sex ed at the age of 10, and then at the age of 11, and then in, when we started high school after that, because like we started high school at 12, yeah. then um, we were just expected to know it. It was just like, you know, there isn't sex ed, we're just teaching you about sex as part of the science lessons. Yeah. Well, I know like, at UK, well, like you teach it them like these days. Yeah. But, you know, I don't know where this person was from, so... No, but also, you know, we only really had, like, what, two lessons of it? Yeah. So, like, it's... You know, if that's... Not, like, if you're just, you know, you're not good in, like, learning in classes or whatever, sometimes that's just not enough for you, and, like... True. It's a problem. Sex education for me was... Oh, no! Oh, you spooded. It was really bad, because, like, my primary school used the same video that my secondary school used huh. so I, I had two lessons on it and both had the same video and was like what am i supposed to learn that's different now that i'm like two years older i remember my um my uh year six sex ed video that they played it made me feel sick oh. really gross they actually had like a camera inside a woman's vagina oh. and like I don't know what they did maybe it was synthetic looking back at it but like I don't know it looked, like, it looked real enough to me when I was 11 yeah but like you could see the guy's dick coming in and out as well so there must have been a camera like sort of if it was real there would have been a camera like you turning in there while oh. this lady was getting fucked and like it was oh, super oh. gross it was super gross. It made me feel like hot and sick. I was just like, ugh, that's, that's nasty. The only thing I remember from my sex ed videos was there was this badly drawn like outline of a man and woman having sex. And then there was like this theatrical bit where there was a swimming pool. There was a lady in the middle, all dressed up, covered in like flowers and whatnot. Yeah. And all these men like were doing synchronized swimming around her, diving in the pool. And sometimes they'd jump out and they'd flop around because they're dying sperm. And huh. And it was just like, what's going on? <laughs> um. So it's, okay, I remember the part that made me feel sick about it, but I also remember just before that there was like. This man and this woman who were, I guess they were supposed to be having sex, but looking back at it, they were fucking still as a board. It was just a guy on top of a woman under some covers. And then, like, the presenter lady walked into their room, just like, they're having sex. <laughs> Get out, then! 
But, like, why I remember that is because she said that, like, she said, like, the man's penis and the woman's vagina fit together like a jigsaw puzzle. And I was like, I don't push my jigsaw puzzles into each other. <laughs> That's how you break them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now it's not coming back out. I was like, you could have done anything else for that. Yeah. You could have been like, uh... Could have healed. Probably, could have healed. Probably should have healed. Always heal before sex. Sonic says. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm actually gonna let Piffy maybe take a dive here. Did you see that image where it's like, Sonic says always pee after sex? Yes, I've seen that. <laughs> Ooh, they don't actually attack me. Yeah, what's something that goes in and out? Mm, burgers. Okay. <laughs> the penis and the vagina fit together like a burger chain that doesn't exist in our country. Yeah. Awesome. I think you're actually going to win. I think so, yeah. He's just used, Holy shit, used yeah. him over screen twice. Like, for one health, dude. Dude. 29. Yeah, baby. Okay, cool. You're kidding, right? And we'll finish up the radio tower next time on Charlotte and Z play video games for you. For the win. For the... <laughs> well, I have to save somebody. You don't, I don't... Use your bike. Save the game as well. Okay. Oh, no! We're fighting him off camera, fuck it. Alright. Bye, everyone. Bye-bye.